So you guys can actually see that um, these guys are, are very rough. And they've got these um these basically cryptic patterns. Oh my gosh, let me make you go to front. So these guys, what these guys do is unlike cobras, um puff adders actually sit in one place and they'll wait for their food to come to them. So there's some reports of these guys waiting in the same spots for like three weeks, four weeks on end, waiting for a rat to run by. If you find these guys in the wild, sometimes you can pick them up and the grass beneath them has actually died because they've been there so long. Imagine how loose his skin is as well. That's because of the big prey. Yeah, so these guys can eat large, large rats. Like, I mean, like, right, like that. Easy. So this is actually a girl. The reason you can tell it's a girl is because of the tail. So a male will have a tail about that long. Uh, this thing is a proportionally smaller tail, and the males are usually much prettier than the girls. Uh, it also holds for humans. Slimy mosquitoes. Wait, how does the mosquito feel? It's so nice. It's soft. Oh my gosh, please don't bite me. It feels, like it, it feels like there's stuff inside. Yeah, it feels like it's it feels like you can peel it. Really? It's like eating a huge rat. Oh yeah. no. <laughs> is it a rat? Yeah. Feel it. You can feel like oh, there's something in there. How is another snake in it? You don't feel like a So the one thing. My guys, this one thing. The one thing about snakes is that they are basically a very, very, very long body. What you have here is the, the vent at the bottom here. And then there's, um, do you want to just hold the tail? All of this is intestine, all of this is stomach, there's lungs and heart, and then the neck. So its shoulders are about here, and its pelvis is here. So this is an all body from about here down to there. And all the way along is just ribs. Lots and lots and lots and lots of ribs. And around this stomach. Like right now? Like right now. Did you not feel it? Do you like all this stuff? Guys, someone. I want to feel this. Is it alive? Oh, no, this is a rat's dead, yeah. There is a rat in here. You don't kind of feel it. I think I feel like it's plastic. Look. Oh my god. I feel something up here. Yeah. Are there snakes you put? Um, yeah. So, uh, oh, these are snakes that give live birth. Uh, they will develop their young inside their um, ovaries. And then they'll give birth to live little snakes. Feels like you can peel it. Yeah, you can. So the one thing that's really cool is if you look at the head, yeah? If you look at the head, so you'll see the eyes actually match with the actual patterning in the scales. That's because this snake cannot rely on hunting. It's slow. So you see its body is very thick set. It's one enormous muscle. Cobras are very thin because cobras look for their food. These guys wait for their food. So these guys are one really big muscle because when they, when they strike, they have to hit something once every two weeks, every three weeks, so they can't miss. So these guys are much faster strikers than cobras. Cobras can only strike from the top of their hood down. These guys can strike the length of their entire body. They're like a coiled spring. And when they bite, they, they, they strike so fast sometimes that they can hit a balloon and the balloon doesn't pop before it's back. So these guys are very fast strikers. Yeah? Are cold blooded, but they're alive. Bitten by a snake. So, Vipers give birth to my All the other ones are eggs. But if you get to the hospital, then. Yeah, the Vipers are bitten by a snake. All the other ones are eggs. Because we actually did the course. That's actually It's all big fat. Snakes are very good. They strike and they bite the same one. They do it and they turn it So there's a big myth that babies are more dangerous because they kind of. It's not true. They, the baby is like as dangerous as the adult. It's just less venom in the venom gland because it's not as big venom. So, yeah, it's just that. Pointy end, yeah. <laughs> and guess what? There's even more. Can we get close, ma'am? Yes, yes, you know you can. Look at him slithering. You get three hours, four hours. 
Yeah, he's trying to get him one. He's our way out. He's one of the only ones we've seen that can reach the top of the bucket. He's so big. It's just amazing. Oh, you don't need to. So, so the snacks that kill you, the anti venom they use is works for all four venom except one. So, if you can buy a venom snack, they'll use the same anti venom black mamba, green mamba, a gaboon adder, a puff, uh, puff adder, and a wrinkles. The only one that's got a different anti venom is a worm snack. So what they'll do, you'll say I got bitten by a snake, go to the hospital, they'll go, what did you get bitten by? You say, I don't know, they, 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 it's fine. They take your blood, they put it in a vial, they turn it upside down. If the blood does not clot, um, then it was a bumps line. This one I've never seen a bite some move for, so. Try. <laughs> so sweet. Um, and it'll eat them whole. So it'll stretch its, its head around these eggs so much that it can eat an egg that's three times as big as So, this. question. Like can you kill it by just crushing it right now? You probably could. <laughs> like if you could, well, not good. Like it and crush too you too, or you kill you too. <laughs> it's so sweet, so slow. You guys want to try and hold? Yes, sir. You guys just support her body. She's very inquisitive. Oof. Oof, she's crushing. <laughs> oh no, she's got me wrapped. And she's unwinding. Was oh, she tying cold? Yeah, this feels weird. So this is a red <laughs> It's semi venomous. Uh, it's it's got my arm. Be a little bit scratchy. And I get bitten by this thing all the time. Uh, nothing really happens. Everything that can't kill you, I've been bitten by. Um, I'm bitten by puff uh, No, that thing will kill me. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I, I'm really oh, these guys: the co cobra, the wrinkles, and the bombslung. But uh, these ones are all super chill. This one is probably the most common snake in Gramstown. Eats frogs. Is that a no, this is a red lip that I wouldn't have a worm's yeah. <laughs> so, so this thing eats uh, frogs and toads. So the reason that they tie the head is actually because they smell using their tongue. Oh, there's the head. And yeah, they smell. Sorry, they smell. So um, they pick up scent in suspension and they follow it. The reason their tongue is forked because there's more smell to the left than the right. Oh, there's the head. The right. So you guys are welcome to hold this one. It can bite you, um, but it's unlikely to. It's a pretty chill one. I've been holding this one. This one's never bitten me before. The other ones, and this, some of them do, some of them don't. That's one bite you before. Um, that's when you put in one other person. Does it have its fangs on? Uh, no, they're always on. <laughs> but I'm saying it does bite. It's, like, it's, like, it's not like an on-off button. Like they're in there, so they'll just bite you. But if they do inject you with venom, like uh, you might get a bit of swelling, maybe a little bit of a headache, but that's about it. It hurts oh. a little bit only if they hold on. So these, I've got a reputation for being bitten a lot by this species snake. These snakes always bite me, but uh, other people are generous. No, this one's been bitten once. I'm pretty sure I saw this like Red outside my house. You respect her and she won't bite you. Just don't grab her head. She's gonna be inquisitive. And... It's wonder. You get it? You get it? You just get it? wonder. There is about a hollow brown snake. That was a house snake that moved out of the street. There's another one. I don't know why, why there's a bug our farmers at home, but as soon as they sneeze, snake, they'll grab the biggest gun they can find. Every single time, yeah. Every single time. When you just caught a snake in the two positions, it's like their body's hanging on the and then their spines actually get stretched. Okay, so when you're holding a snake, always support the body. Yeah. Sir, yeah. so, I just feel like move I can that move, way. Move, that way. <laughs> move that way. Oh, this thing is so cute. It feels so. It doesn't have anything. It goes up and down. Yeah, it's very, it's very smooth. Are we doing with the set? Can I please pick up this thing? You can hold the head. Hold the most dangerous part. Come take a picture with me with this thing. I think we can lick me. Oh, <laughs> lick me. Oh, why is its body looking around with different colors? Oh, it's just the way the light refracts off its scales. They can all bite, but uh, everything, everything can bite.
She looks like a squid. It's moving, it's moving. Ma'am, 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 ma'am. She said eat, ma'am. Oh, no. She's not, she's not, she's not flail her arm. <laughs> Start. Oh, she's the most friendly snake in Grahamstown. Mm. That snake's more popular than I am in this mm. Grahamstown. What's you his name? Shiva. Shiva. Yeah. The snake's exceptionally friendly. If a snake could be friendly, it's friendly. Can I please take the snake to take a picture? Don't drop! Don't drop! Don't drop! Don't drop! Don't drop. Trust it. Looks, um, but it's gonna be a bit. So what's she looking for now? So okay, let's just let's just say she does not have a fangs. Just say it. She doesn't got she hasn't got fangs, now she's got teeth. Yeah. She has got teeth. But not the poison. It touches my his head touches my hand and goes. There you go. He's not let go of the head as soon as you take it. So what will happen? Hey, so what is this one? It's fine. They've got uh, the vertebrae. Nope. Not the only one. Oh, there's the one. Oh, there's the one. Yeah, like What's this guy doing? It's like wrapped in. Why won't he make it? It's like it's a good So give her something to read. Yeah. Doing. Oh, <laughs> Waiting, <aren't you? laughs>